Hey everybody, welcome back to the Juggernaut Five Pillars of Snatch Technique. Uh, today we're gonna go over the snatch pull or what we call the snatch deadlift. This is the, the first movement, the initial pull of the bar off the ground up to the hips. So there's a few key points here we wanna really drive home. Uh, and these are some things that are really gonna make a big difference in snatching well and make sure your bar path is really good. So this is gonna assume the start position we learned in the last video. She's gonna get set. As she pushes from the ground with her legs, her knees are gonna push out a little bit and back in order for the bar to pass them. When she gets to the top of the position, she should be right here, right before the place where she actually would make contact with the bar. Legs are relatively straight, as straight as they're gonna get during the lift. Bar is close, lats are tight, chest is still out, and shoulders are still above the barbell. One mistake is if the hips are rising too fast, the bar is gonna come out in front of her and she's gonna to have to chase forward to get to the bar, killing all the power she'd have at the top. And then another mistake, keeping her butt down too much and leaning back too early, dragging the bar around her knees. In this case, what happens is the bar is gonna travel around her knees rather than past her knees. Her shoulders are behind the bar at the top. She's lost any ability to generate power in this position. Another key point here, we wanna focus on the lats, their action at the top. When her lats are tense, the bar is right next to her and close. If she was to keep her lats relaxed or she had relaxed them, the bar is gonna travel in front of her a little bit too much. Really important, as you stand up, the bar sweeps backward because of the action in the lats. She's actively trying to pull the bar towards her hips here. So in conclusion, we went over the first pull or the snatch deadlift. Some major points you wanna focus on. As you push off the ground, you're using your legs to move the bar. Your knees have to move back and outward some, to some degree. Also, keeping the shoulder directly above the bar as long as possible. When you get to the top of the pull, your lats need to be tense, pushing the bar back towards your hips while you keep your shoulder over the bar the entire time. If you guys like this video, go ahead and subscribe to the YouTube page and keep a lookout for the next in our series on the five pillars of snatch technique.